the tenth pair of confusion is justice and revenge. How could God create human government according to Romans chapter 13 to allow legal hurt? If God allows hate by authorities to pawns, why are pawns forced to forgive? I have fear that authorities are not going to be remorseful after an apology from a pawn. In the American Pledge of Allegiance, they should change the words and justice for all to and justice for some because not everybody is going to get justice and authorities get justice after bullying and I am one of those people who did not get justice. Do you think that it is justice to deny permission frequently to a licensee after peaceful permission request? No, it is not because not giving permission frequently is selfish and selfishness counts as murder. Thus, licensor's responsibility. How could murder is justice when licensors keep denying permission to his slash her enemies or when the death penalty by a justice system is done or when the military uses war to solve problems? The 11th pair of confusion is discipline and abusive punishment. Most authority figures like to use the word slash word forms punishment. I hope that authority figures are happy by dumping the general public from society by using outrageous laws. I look at earth as a spiritual realm because of the clue citizen as in Philippians chapter 3 verse 20 with American citizenship and because of the clue punishment as in eternal separation from God in the Bible with segregation from communities or with imprisonment or with death. This confusion reminds me of Revelation chapter 20 and of Revelation chapter 21 verse 8. Because you have been sentenced to punishment for violating any ridiculous law and because you face the facts that people lead you to heartbrokenness with no achievements on earth and because patience to pardon you fails it makes you to feel that you do not want people in your life permanently I feel like Job not everybody is going to receive honor because our so-called objective is to break people's hearts by using the legal system to see who the number one person is and to see whose beliefs are the best. Have you ever heard of competition in the business world? I think of Earth as a lion's den or as a chessboard. Because individual results may vary by a different culture, obsoleteness of the difference between right and wrong is included too. We go by luck instead of research. For the Christians who do not believe in luck, God is in control of everything so he can replace competition with coexistence.